Hello, 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 my dear friends, welcome to my channel. My name is Abhilash and I'm your trader next door. In this video, I'll be analyzing the chart of GBP, JPY, British Pound, Japanese Yen for 1st April. Tomorrow, I'll come again with the analysis for 2nd April. I bring videos on daily basis and in advance so that you get to stay ahead of the market and you do not miss any opportunity. So please do subscribe to my YouTube channel for regular market analysis and do check out the forex analysis playlist for the analysis of other currency pairs and as i mentioned uh, in my other videos also that from today onwards i'll be going for a detailed analysis so that uh, you can become a better trader because i have received many messages where people have uh, expressed their pain of losing money on trades because they do not understand the market well they are beginner so I have decided that from today onwards, uh, I'll be going for detailed analysis, uh, multi-time frame analysis so that uh, you can understand the market better, you get the complete picture and you do not take any foolish decision. <laughs> that is the main purpose. <laughs> okay, so let's jump to the chart. So as you can see, uh, market is trading at 152.67. Okay, and as we all know, market was in great uptrend and after the market crossed the support yes market was an uptrend taking support at the 50 moving average it was like a fairy tale okay but market broke the support and support and see market fell to support here and went up again okay and as you can see i have drawn two lines here okay this is the support line and this is the resistance line because from this point only market fell so this huh, there, huh, we can expect that yes this point will act as a resistance for the market 152.56 okay 65 and as of now you can see that market is just trading at the sub oh, sorry resistance level so let's jump to the other time frame so this is the weekly time frame of Japanese uh, British pound Japanese yen and on the weekly time frame we can see that last week it has made a hammer pattern okay and this week also it has made a beautiful green candle and as you can see there is not much trouble on the chart here okay it's doing great it's doing great yes there is a resistance here but this uh, we need uh, we need to wait okay because this resistance belongs to 2018 level okay if you want to see yes see this resistance belongs to 2018 level so as of now we can see that market is a beautiful uptrend and yes looking at the previous uh, week's candle and this week's candle we can say that yes the uptrend is there and we should be only looking for buying opportunity okay this part is clear as trend of the market is bullish this is the chart of british pound japanese yen for 2021 since uh, january and as you can see beautiful 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 uptrend no doubt about it okay just in this portion market uh, market fell but after that you can see market has <clears throat> market has resumed its uptrend and again going up and as you can see market has crossed this level also okay so that's a good news so considering both the chart what should be a strategy then weekly chart positive overall trend you have you have seen beautiful uptrend very much bullish therefore we should be only looking for buying opportunity okay as of now you can see that okay as of now you can see that market is just trading at the resistance level and stochastic rsi is also in the overbought zone so you do not need to trade right now because if you place the buy order here right now okay if you place the buy order here you do not have the ideal position to put your stop loss you cannot keep your stop loss here this is no, this distance is too much okay this distance is too much You'll, it will wipe out your whole capital okay if you are not aware of risk management so this is not the ideal position to buy okay ideal position to buy is huh, just above the support and to buy just above the support what do we need to do okay we just need to wait for the market to cross this level 
cross this level when market will cross this level okay cross this level beautifully comfortably then just wait and watch the market and just observe the price see i am just trying to give you a, a safer entry i am i do not want you to enter uh, in a rush okay and it will hit your stop loss okay. i want you to have a proper entry when market will be when market will cross this level comfortably just observe the price if you see that yes market is trading comfortably above the resistance for five to six hours four hours three hours okay then yes it is a confirmation that yes the resistance has become the support now and we do not need to worry then your next duty is to look at the position of the stochastic rsi if you see that stochastic rsi is in overbought zone then avoid it okay avoid it you do not need to buy though market is above this level you do not need to buy because market will come down market will come down to take risk market will eventually uh, come down to breathe a little to have some air fresh air okay therefore wait for the market or, or no, wait for the market to cool off and keep your eyes on stochastic rsi when stochastic rsi will be in oversold zone okay when stochastic rsi in oversold zone and it will be ready to go up again like this then just look at the position of the price if you see that market is still trading above this level 152.65 level then it's the excellent position to execute the buy order and on the other hand if you see that market has crossed this level the market has crossed this level and it is about to go up then also you can go for a buy order just you need to be uh, cautious at this level okay otherwise you can also go for a buy order but when market will be in overbought zone you should not place the buy order because it, uh, there is a high chance that uh, your trade will hit the stop loss but the, so the best position to buy is above this level above this level above 152.65 level when stochastic rsi will also be in your favor okay that will be the safest entry okay safest entry yes it may take time but yes at least you will not lose your money that is more important secondly okay secondly if you see that uh, market has crossed this resistance level okay and stochastic rsi is about to go up then also you can enter into the market but just be cautious at this level 152.65 in case it crosses the level then you do not need to worry let it go. let it fly okay. because overall the trend is very much bullish so it's a, uh, it's a <coughs> good pair to go for buying order only and, uh, and if you are an intermediate tra uh, trader and if you have got some experience okay and if you see that market has taken some uh, market is coming down from here taking resistance okay you can short the sorry you can short the market below this line okay but that will be uh, that is only for uh, experienced traders if you see some good selling pressure or good resistance then only otherwise forget about it <laughs> okay so these are the uh, trading opportunities in gbp jp1 hopefully you have understood and if you have liked the video and found the video informative please give a thumbs up and please do not forget to subscribe to my channel for regular market analysis thank you so much all the best see you tomorrow and do subscribe